Well, hey, 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 what is going on, everybody? So, welcome to my tutorial this evening, and I hope everyone is doing well, despite what's going on going on around us in the world with this cro cro uh, coronavirus and all this other mess that's going on around that. And, uh, well, this evening, guys, I hope to uh, kind of put that aside and uh, go over this good old PS3 here, and uh, I'm going to be showing you how to... Take a PSP game and convert it over to a package file. That way you can install it as you would a regular PS3 game. Uh, now this program that I have that allows you to convert it over to a package file will not only do that, but it will allow you to actually customize it also. You can uh, change your thumbnail picture, your background picture, and even your music. Um, so it's pretty cool. Uh, so here in a second, I'll be going over to the computer, guys. I'll be showing you what to download and all that good stuff. It's not that really, it's not that hard, really. Uh, so uh, I'm bored right now, and I've just gotten back into the PS3 a couple weeks ago. And so I thought I'd just throw this out there to you guys. I Most of you probably already know how to do it. Who knows, you know, but I'm throwing it out there anyway. So... I hope y'all enjoy it. I hope y'all learned something. And uh, yeah, let's keep going with this. Cool. All right. Okay, guys. So like in all my tutorials, uh, you're either going to download a couple of files or, or a program or whatever. Uh, so let's mosey on over to the internet here. Internet Explorer. And this is uh, my personal upload This uh, on Mediafire. Uh, this is the PSP to PS3. This, this is the program that will convert your PSP games into a package file. Alright, so go ahead and download that guys. And, uh, and let me bring up these right here. So this is going to be your download. This is your uh, program right here guys. And over here uh, you will need also an ISO, a PSP ISO. And just kind of Google a couple pictures, guys. Uh, whatever, whatever you want to download. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is my thumbnail, and this is going to be my background picture. And uh, in, under the description, I will have the the sizes in which you need to resize these pictures. So my uh, thumbnail. If you go down here to edit. My thumbnail is 144 by 80. Okay, that's my thumbnail picture. Uh, my background picture, guys, is gonna be 480 by 272. That's gonna be my background picture. Uh oh. I would I would have uh, incorporated an, a uh, music file, guys, uh, but unfortunately, um, my Go Wave I cannot seem to install the AT3 or the A Track 3 uh, program or file or whatever you want to call it to be able to transfer the uh, MP3 or WAV file into an AT3 file. Uh, I did that back like nine years ago. I even got a, a YouTube video on that, but I, I was using Windows 7 back then, and now I'm using Windows 10, and it doesn't seem to be working right. So until then, guys, uh, if I do get it working, uh, I will surely make a video of that also. All right, so once you got your pictures, guys, and not only... Once you have your pictures, you, they cannot be JPG, okay? They got to be PNG. So, we have to go back to our internet here, and this will also be under the description. This is JPG to PNG. And you come down here to Upload Files, and just select your file, guys, and it'll automatically upload it here, okay? Go to upload again, and we'll upload this one here. Okay, 
and now we will download them. Okay. And so that's that. Now we got our PNG. What the heck? Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> Man. Alright. So we want to delete these two here, the JPG files. <clears throat> Alright, so we have to rename these guys. Okay. Uh, what I do, uh, I just double click on my ISO go into game here and right here guys uh, you want to look at your icon 0 PNG right here um, what you want to do is yikes little where's it at are you serious Okay, so it doesn't have a rename here. I don't know how I did it last time. How did I do that last time? Anyway, it's going to be icon zero and it's going to be pick one. This is going to be your thumbnail here. Okay? And this one here is going to be your background. Alright? So, icon zero and pick one. Okay? All in caps. And why did I do that? All right, so let's let's try this again. Okay. So this is going to be icon one. Or icon zero. Okay. This is going to be a uh, pick one. Okay. okay, so that's what you got to rename them right there, guys. Icon zero and pick one. Okay, now you want to come over here to your program. Open it up. Very simple. Uh, let's see. Check this off, guys. Icon right there. What in the world? Okay. Let's browse for the, C, uh, the ISO first. Okay. Okay. There we go. So this is what the original uh, icon uh, thumbnail and background would look like. Uh, but we're going to change that to these two. Okay. So we'll leave all that alone. And now what we want to do is down here to build package and just hit just uh, right click on it left click on it I mean. and just hold on a second this won't take a minute because my computer is so stinking slow I got so much crap on my computer I mean I just do a lot of work on my computer. I'd be downloading stuff here and there, and, and <laughs> it's just it's just nuts. So, what I'm asking is, be patient. That's all. Okay. So you will get this thing right here popped up, guys. Just click out of it and hit OK right here. And this guys is what you want to pay attention to okay so you want to take your picture here your icon zero PNG and you want to replace it just drag it over guys just like that and replace okay uh, the same thing with this one just drag it over replace it and here's your AT3 file. That is your that is your music here, your background music to your uh, your game here. And 
and uh, this is the one thing that I really wanted to change but guys I could not get the AT3 file installed for Gold Wave for some reason it just won't work on Windows 10 uh, as of yet but I'm gonna try to figure it out all right so after you do that just go over here and click X and hit OK and that's gonna start right in your pack it's gonna start you know kind of Converting it over to a package file, pretty much. <clears throat> and this is uh, this is pretty cool, guys. I mean, I, I wouldn't do a lot of PSP games because I mean. Uh, the way I like to do it guys is I like to have my PS2, PS1, and PSP games in different folders. I don't like to have everything all all together like the PS3, PSP, and all that stuff. I don't like all that together. Uh, I'm just doing this to show you guys uh, on how to do it. Uh, there may be a few games that I really love that I like to just jump right into and that's what I'm going to use this for. Uh, so that's that and this this is one of Mega Man powered up and uh, there's another Mega Man game also but uh, let's see we, we're gonna put this guys on my flash drive here and we're gonna open this up and we're gonna save it right in there just like that and let's see if it went in there it should have all the way down to the bottom and there it is right there guys there's my package file there all right so we can close out of this pretty much everything because we're gonna go over to the ps3 now I'm gonna close the program like I said my computer is all screwed but anyway Meet me over there to PS3 guys and we're gonna check this joker out. Heck yeah. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna scroll on over to our games. And I'm gonna scroll up to our package manager. Alright, so I'm gonna go into that and go to install package files and then standard. And there's our Mega Man powered up package file which we had created from our ISO so we're gonna go ahead and install that it shouldn't take that long it's like 302 megabytes so we'll just sit here and um, wait a second like I said earlier I'm just not gonna install a whole bunch of like PSP games along with the PS3 I, I kind of want to keep them separated you know keep them organized that way you don't have to go through like hundreds of games just to find <laughs> one game that you want to play so uh, yes yeah, it's, it's loading up pretty quick it's a installing pretty quick here so okay install complete so we're going to back out of that guys and uh, there's our game right there jump into it I'll show you that it plays alright so I'm gonna go back I 
Okay. Mega Man. There we go. And it plays just fine, guys. Uh, what's cool about this game is that you can pick from the old style Mega Man and the new style Mega Man. Um, I prefer the new style. It's really cool. I like the cartoony look of the uh, game. And so, yeah. Let me show you. The year 2000X. With the advancement of science, human... I'll skip this part over. Yeah, I, 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 like, I like the way it's, uh, oh, oh my god. I like the cartoony look, though. I really do, so. Okay, well that's that, guys. Uh, as you can see, the PSP game really does work if you, uh, install it as a pack file. Cool. Uh, so I hope this, like, kind of gave you guys Stop. some ideas, Otherwise... h helped you out or whatever like that, and, uh, What insanity! Well, Using my robots to conquer the world! Appreciate you, appreciate you guys please, checking my video out, and I will see robot. you guys Mega? maybe next time on the next child. Let's Play, or, uh, please, whatever you get really myself into, maybe anymore. tutorial, I or whatever. Strong enough yet. Mega. Hopefully I can get some... Mm going on with a PS2, right. I don't know yet. I understand. But, until I then guys, y'all take it easy, and I will see I you guys the necessary later. Roll. Thanks you for watching. Assist.